Okay. I think that's it. Hey, Rafe and Nadine must have dozens of guys out there. They just stumble onto the treasure to blind it up. Here's the ladder. What's up, Sally? on the other side. Okay, gets in... Guess if we just need to go back to the car. So let's head back to the car, guys. There it is. Now let's get a move on. There needs to be a way out of here. Wait. No, not up here, though. Ah. Yeah, how do we get out here now? Not this way, though, because it would take me to my, to my dad. It would take me to my dad. Yep, yep. Take me to my death. Uh. The rest of that bridge looks like it could come down in a minute. Yes, it could. Oh! Yeah, yeah, right. What if we 
Trummers are a bigger cut than Rafe. No, that's not how she operates. She's more of a money up front kind of mercenary. Rafe's got the advantage there. Oh, of course. Look, shoreline. Yeah, they're definitely going all in, aren't they? And getting awful close to that volcano. So they're gonna say a damn thing. But they found the treasure already. But look, they're searching every inch of this place. If they found it already, they wouldn't be searching. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. So, so what does that, that have to do with us? Hey, Sam. You don't mind me asking. How'd you pass the time in prison? Uh, you know, reading, mostly. There was this one guard saw me as a charity case, I guess. He had to check out books from the library for me. What'd you read? History, uh, especially anything related to Avery and other pirates. Just in case, you know. Sure. But you know, besides books, push-ups, smoking, trying to stay out of fights between rival gangs, it's a whole lot of thinking. That's pretty much it.